What's going on? What's going to happen? What's going Oh my, he's gone again! <laughs> and he's only broken the bit of his runway! He's only broken the little... He was this far up in the air, man! It's another weekend in the UK lockdown, and it's another weekend to try and have some laughter here. We're back again looking at my subreddit. Now over 13,000 strong on towards 15k, and apparently 60 million subscribers from Arav. I mean, I think that's a little bit incorrect, just a bit incorrect, but uh, I like the optimism, right? The optimism. And we've got a, a lovely new display going on. We've got a very nice banner, which is an animated banner, which is a very smooth transition. Transition, I must say, and also I've always actually really liked that shot from Zandvoort of the Vodafone Mercedes car we've got in my team currently, and then we've got a very uh, well uh, kind of epileptic warning fit, maybe if you don't like flashing colours. But let's go on then to the top of the last week and see if you guys can make me laugh with some clips and some F1 memes as per usual. Kimmy is just Kimmy. If you ever feel useless, there's an engineer who has to communicate with Kimmy. It really is uh, very very. Yeah, useless job because most of the time he doesn't want to hear information and when he does you have to keep it very short and sweet Me creating new accounts to get a one month free trial <laughs> Brussel, he's, he's been around hasn't he? He's been around quite a fair bit Racing Point, Mercedes, Mercedes, Williams uh, And in two different eras of Mercedes of course he was in the he tested Mercedes cars back in the day I think the 2017 one I think it was uh, when they were full silver obviously this year He went for the Sakir in the black livery and then I actually forgot he actually did test for Racing Point in one of the practice sessions did he not just before he entered uh, I think F2 or GP2 at the time or well, actually maybe just before he entered F1 he tested out the Racing Point car but yeah that is uh, very very true just getting the one month for each in the case of Mercedes he got the one race trial apparently Danny Rick getting a present from a mechanic before he leaves <laughs> what is that that face and combo. Surely this was set up. This has got to be set up. This is too, too perfect of a situation where the guy is looking away comedically. He's made it. This was all a setup. This was a ruse. Ferrari level strategy. Stay out while Hamilton pits and win the race. Box at the same time as Hamilton if it... I didn't realise this was about me. Ah. Oh. Look, it wasn't my finest moment, but things happen in the spur of the moment when you have a few seconds to decide things like that. <laughs> the disappointment. Oh, this is fast. Oh, this is not fast. <laughs> that was a great team radio from Science in Austria. It's still a very funny one after being away for so, so long after that initial lockdown last year and then getting used to the speeds of F1 again. But uh, yeah, along the same lines, don't know if he'll, he's going to feel as fast in the Ferrari, but I don't think he'll care. He's in a red car. It's a dream for him come true. Alpines, Alpines main sponsor, Pepsi Max. Uh, can't, can't see properly and then focus in and it is you know what actually he's got, he's got a point there I don't actually realize the the logo splashes on the on the side there do kind of look like obviously it is the uh, the French flag colors but um from the side angle yeah and and to be honest when the full livery comes in with the blue it'll just look like normal Pepsi uh, Pepsi not even Pepsi Max Carlos testing the SF2 what oh no what is this edit <laughs> <laughs> Why is it? It's been made to look like the car from, from Cars. That's awesome. That's a sick design, no matter what. What on earth is that? It's like half tractor, half cycle, half PLP 50. What's going on here? Oh, he's spun. He's spun. He's the very Ferrari of him. Very Ferrari of him. <laughs> what is this contraption? Please, someone in the comments. Explain, whoever, if you know, if someone knows, what is this machine called? Why does it, exi it exist? What's the context of this video? <laughs> Say Alpha, Alpha, Towery, Towery, Alpha, Towery, Alpha, Towery. Oh dear, if you don't know the context, uh, then you haven't clearly watched my drunk pred predictions of the 2021 season with Niren, my flatmate. Um, yeah, I'll just ro just roll the clip. Hang on a second, you put Alpha Tauri. You missed the H of the writing. <laughs> you weren't even drunk for that far. Not my finest moment. I don't know. I don't know how I wrote it wrong sober before I even got drunk for the video. Happy hour of a not- ah, see, I commented below on this video, I did, I did, I enjoyed it, I watched the entire thing. 
Lovely. And did you realize I tweeted it out this week? Jensen Button, he's been signed to Williams as a senior advisor. Okay, this we are now Williams supporters. I will not be slagging them off anymore, okay? No more road to glories with Williams in the future on any new game, okay? We now support Williams with all our backing because JB is at the team now. Getting tired of using that keyboard at Harrow after restarting his survive race for the 69,420th time. I like what we've done there. Nice, nice. Uh, uh, yeah, that is actually live scenes. That's like after, like when we're getting to like the last tenth of the video. And I'm just like, I just want to end. We've been recording for like an hour. It's going to become a 20 long video. But I've had to sit there for an hour doing restarts like that and trying to get through it. It is a pain. An absolute pain. Sorry, a bit late. First post, Mercedes at secure, be like. Okay, oh no, oh no. This is going to be an absolutely gopping pit stop situation. We're at Monaco on F1 2020 in the McLaren here. And is there going to be a massive... Oh, oh, they've gone in. They're, they're, they're not even... They've walked away! They've walked... The two guys walked away from the pit stop. <laughs> What? Oh, no, they realized. Quick, quickly, lads. Go back, go back. The guy's in. Quick, change the pit stop. <laughs> the guys have been laughing as well. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. Great po first post, mate. Great. We love this kind of F1 game content. That is amazing. The way they just nonchalant. The way the guy, this guy, he's kneeling. And then he just, oh, no, nah, the car's here. It's time to go. Time to go, lads. Ferrari strategist be like, driver in clean air, bring him in. Driver still likes the tyres, bring him in. Driver's going to come out in traffic, bring him in. Pit for hard tyres, short stint, pit for mediums, long stint. Makes sense to me. That is a great sum up, you know. That really does sum up a lot of the strategies of Ferrari over the last... Four years? Five years? Yeah, I mean, I mean, to be fair, a lot of the years, to, if we're being real. Pro Force India tried to end Mercedes domination before it began, circa 2009. I actually ducked. Okay, we're on a set of course here. Okay, rate the, the different game, but F1 content still. We've got a pretty nice 09 mod going on as well. Right, what's going on here? Right, around the outside. Oh, he's had a bit of a wobble. Yellow flags up ahead. Oh! Mama, jeez. Okay. Once again, a set of course at AI do not disappoint with their erraticness. That is, yeah, that is. Uh, I would have ducked as well in the cockpit. I would have fully gone like this. Oh, what the? <laughs> New racing line in Canada. Okay, F2 cars as well, you know. Oh, bit of contact there. Oh, there's a more wheel, a wheel, but it's the true F2 racing. We're watching it here. Right, he's, he's paused it in the middle of an online race. Not. Not maybe what you want to do, but he's lost another position. Oh dear. Oh no. What's happening here? Three wide into the shaka. Oh my. Hold it. Hold it. Spin it around. Yes. How's he done that? He didn't even spin his wheel. He just sat there and just let it go spin him. He didn't even move his steering wheel. I don't think he didn't really move that much. Okay, he moved it a little bit, but that in that subtlety maybe helped him there. Some top tier saves there. Well done, mate. Well done. <laughs> Can it be true? 2010 v 2021. Okay, season opener. In oh, of course, is this song. Season opener in Bahrain. A Spanish driver who previously uh, raced for Renault and McLaren debuts with Ferrari. Braun GP, now Mercedes, won both titles the previous year. And a Red Bull, wait, I didn't read the rest of it. A Red Bull driver won the Abu Dhabi GP the previous year and then went on to win the title. <laughs> <laughs> that, that song, so that still cracks me up. <laughs> well, Max Verstappen fans, maybe it's all coming together. Sometimes, you know, in, in life, history does love to repeat itself. Maybe it's time. Maybe it's time. Yes, I saw this on Instagram. I reposted this photo on Instagram, but massive shout out to Milk Badger on Instagram. Some insane, insane fan art. Like, I love these so much. Like, these, and it's sick. And this one as well, rate the color splash. Because that's very me. This is my kind of vibe. Color splashing everywhere, using bold colors. Very, very sick. Love that, man. Love it. Girls, boys don't know what true pain is. Boys, one image. <laughs> 
I mean, that image is now, like, without any context, if you're an F1 fan and you watch Sakir, you know straight away what that image is. No explanation is needed whatsoever. It all comes full circle. The circle of life. Brazil, 2001. Backmarker Joss Verstappen takes out leader Montoya. Brazil, 2018. Backmarker Ocon takes out leader Verstappen. It's, uh, what did I say? History. Look, it's not a repeat, but history has a funny way of coming back round. Thank you, I guess. Right. What's going on here? Oh, online race. But Oh! Yes, thank you very much indeed. Thank you, sir. My God, that man just got yeeted to Hungary. And he's in, there's an airborne part as well, right there. Right there, he gets tipped on. <laughs> Fully decked off. Out of existence. Oh, if I was that dude, what a shame. You're just going along, minding your own business, and then... <laughs> best truck in the world. Calm yourself. You're not Fernando Alonso. <laughs> what? <laughs> that's a great... That's a really decent uh, effort on the back of a truck to make, make sure you're not, like, going around, I'm, I'm guessing, like, trying to overtake or overcut the truck or whatever. <laughs> New chicane at Spa. Right, let's see. Where are we going? Uh, what the... <laughs> I was not ready for that. I was not ready for that. I thought he was going to turn left and cut the corner. Or there's going to be some sort of racing line he's taking. I was not expecting a full helicopter to be flying through the circuit, let alone. But we've seen a glitch like that where they fly low. But through the circuit, you know, in, in the tarmac. <laughs> Tight F1 grid in Among Us. A little, plus a little surprise. <laughs> this is very, very sick. Kudos, man. Very. That's must have taken a lot of time to actually do this uh, with every single driver. I mean, you've got even the little details of the helmets. Are very, very sick. Full grids. Full grid and a little surprise. Apparently, we've got three. We have, wait, is this the full? Yeah, it's full twenty. What's the surprise? <laughs> oh no. No, Albon the imposter. Oh, come on, man. Day 34 without F1. Saved 0 0.4 seconds on my way back home. Normal people, F1 fans. I mean, that's the apex. That's the Tim at Mardik and me line. That's the cut in the corner line there. Next question, how did I not retire? Okay, what's going on here then? Oh, what was that? What was that? He just got stopped in mid. He just got... What? Okay, looks like the game, F1 game, good as ever, good as ever, loving that. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Wait, no, no, there can't be more. This can't be again, is this the same race? Is this the same, this is the same race. This is the exact same race. What's going on? What's going to happen? What's going Oh my, he's gone again! <laughs> And he's only broken the bit of his front wing. He's only broken the little... He was this far up in the air, man. Look at him. Look at him. And he only broke his front wing. <laughs> and he's not even out of the race. Oh, Mark. We have had a fantastic Reddit this week. My God. I'm not going to be able to decide what makes a thumbnail and title with this. This is mad. The first two were mad enough, but this one... Look how far he is! The amount of airtime he got was insane with that glitch. Again, we are no, we're not in, we're not in online. We're in my team, my team Brazil. We're in qualifying it. Oh no, he's got it a bit wrong, lad. You've got it very wrong. You've got... And we've got another case of the curious barriers that are just wobbling along, like they did in Australia in that other clip we had at the very start of the year with his with his Reddit. Bruh, bruh. <laughs> What? What is? What's going on? What, what's going on with the F1 game today? Why is it helicopter land? Why? What, what's going on? We're gonna definitely end it off on this because what did you, we had the other helicopter thing before, and now this one, and this one has come out the ground. It's literally come out of the grass like Thunderbirds exiting a secret lair. And then decided to fly away to a crash. I don't know. I don't know if it's a medical helicopter or whatever. Oh, very, very odd. Right, beautiful stuff. Right, beautiful stuff. Well, we're going to end it off there. If you guys did enjoy it, then be sure to hit that like button. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. If you're only around here, do get subscribed for weekly Formula 1 content. I'll see you guys next time. What on earth was the F1 game today? What was it? Goodbye.